mistakes that make people use you. Have you ever noticed that a good person isn't often well respected? They help others out, they're patient, but for some reason they constantly feel upset and lonely. Psychologists believe the reason is mistakes these people make in their behavior. For instance, esteem doesn't have to be the result of actions or behavior. Did you know about that? Here's the most common mistakes you probably do so that people don't respect you and never listen to you. Number 10. Needless self-sacrifice. You suppress your own needs for the sake of peace, but the world doesn't notice it. When people offend you, you feel uncomfortable in front of them. This will inevitably mean that people will upset you over and over again. How to change this? Don't be afraid to tell the world about what you don't like. Actually, it might cost people nothing to meet you halfway. Otherwise, your needless self-sacrifice won't be noticed by anyone at all. Number 9. A lack of self-respect. You don't seem to feel it when people bump into you and you close your eyes to these awkward moments. However, someone who is rude by nature won't love or respect you for that. So why are you putting up with it? If someone behaves in a way that they don't give a damn about you, it means they really don't. Don't look for excuses for rude people. They don't deserve it. Always respect yourself. Number 8. Seeking approval from others. People who always have a need for approval from others give out signals that there's something wrong in their lives. As a result, almost everyone starts avoiding them. What to do? You should stop waiting for praise. You don't need to be told you're a good person to be one. Also, don't be scared of criticism. People will criticize you all the time for anything you do for one reason or another. Keep in mind that your opinion of yourself should always be the most important. Number 7. Thinking that the problem is only yourself. You automatically believe people are right, except when it comes to yourself. You put the responsibility for what's going on around on yourself. No one is going to thank you for this. Taking advantage of you and making your life even harder might be easier for others under such circumstances. There is no point in looking for someone to blame. Torturing yourself won't bring you any love from others, but only pity. You should focus your efforts on finding a solution to the problem. Number 6. Showing off. Emphasizing your victories and begging for respect can lead to a dependent relationship. Trying to convince others that you're a good person, you'll end up getting rejected. You can show you are worth something only by believing in yourself and being yourself. When you know your value, you don't need to prove it to anyone. Number 5. A Fear of Rejection You don't want to upset anyone, even if it makes you unhappy. You pretend everything is okay to prevent other people from worrying. As a result, you are never satisfied. Don't be afraid to say no. Even the nicest people in the world may try to use you if you allow them to. Help others only when you want to. Number 4. Being deaf to your interests. You've become accustomed to adjusting to other people's needs and find it difficult to understand what your desires are. You don't decide what to do for yourself. Instead, you take others' wishes for your own. 
you should know that it's far from the definition of kindness. Learn to listen to your desires and don't be afraid of offending others. Normally, our fears don't have a basis in reality and it's always possible to find a compromise. Number three, you don't limit what's acceptable. You forgive others because it's easier to do so than to stand up for yourself. When other people show disrespect towards you, you find an excuse for them in your mind. You need to determine the limits of acceptable behavior and don't let others overstep these boundaries. People who agree to anything are not respected. Number two, a fear of loneliness. You turn your relationship into a cult and sacrifice yourself. What's more, you feel comfortable doing so. That's why bullies, narcissists, and egoists gravitate toward you. Well, you allow yourself to be used. How to change this? You don't need to choose between your relationship and your self-worth. When others force you to make that choice, then something is going wrong. Be brave and don't be afraid of change. Think of being alone as being free rather than lonely. Only then you won't be alone for long. Number one, you believe you need to earn respect. You don't accept that respect isn't the result of actions or behavior. You don't feel comfortable when your relationship with someone is one of equals as you think you have to earn their respect. You feel that a person has value only when they give something back. You know what? You don't need to buy love or respect. Learn to love and be loved unconditionally. Can you easily find common language with others? 